What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's January, as you know. Well, you might be watching this later on, but I promise the information is good all year. There's no expiration date on this information. So what I want to do, man, we got a lot of people here that are new to this whole dieting thing. I get a lot of subscribers right around New Year's resolution time. And overwhelmingly, a lot of resolutions involve losing weight, building muscle, getting into the gym. But what good is the gym if your diet's not in check, right? What good is a diet if you don't know what you're doing? And kind of like how jelly is no good without peanut butter. A good weightlifting routine is nothing without a good diet. So let me show you guys in this video how to meal prep, but in the easiest way I've found to do it. I'm gonna give you guys a full meal plan. I'm gonna show you how to meal prep and right around like 20 to 30 minutes. It's gonna be super easy. And you can do it every morning if you give yourself a little bit of time. Check it out. It is 6.40 in the morning right now. The sun is not even out yet and we are taking steps to make ourselves better. That's the goal every day, man. Wake up, do something to make your position in life better. So without further ado, we're gonna get this video started. Are you guys ready? Let's do it! Yeah! So step one, you are going to need a big old pan here. I recommend getting a big one because it'll make this way easier. And then you're gonna need a pan. You can put some water in. We gotta do a slight little bit of boiling. Uh, this is all I got is this big guy. If you got a smaller one, that'll work fine too, but I got a big guy. Crucial step one to making this whole process way faster is come down here and preheat your pan. Get that heat going. If you got different zones on here, hold up. One thing you may not know, this side of your oven is just gonna heat like the middle. That side's gonna do like the two outer rims. So if you got a big old boy here make sure you get the one with like all the circles and then sit it like a little above medium high get it like right in there i told you guys we want to keep this simple quick and easy so everybody watching can do this in the morning or you can do it all at once and meal prep for the entire week i like to do it in the morning think the food tastes better all week but really whatever your preference is so if you got the time do it keeping it easy we got white rice we got a cup and a food scale let me show you how we're gonna do this next part you don't exactly have to measure it out i do but all we really need is a cup of rice here so i'm gonna try to measure out about 200 grams boom 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 Boom, almost there, boom, perfect. You can see it right here. That's about exactly a cup of rice. So like I said, you don't gotta weigh it out. I do just, uh, it helps my OCD, but you don't have to, just get a cup of rice. Now we're gonna take our pan, dump our cup of rice in there. And the rule of thumb when you are making rice is that you wanna use double the amount of water as the amount of rice you use. So let's, let's see if we got some mathematicians in the audience. If we had one cup of rice, how much water do we need? I'll wait. If you said two cups, pat yourself on the back because you were right. Another key too, make sure your water is hot. It's gonna bring it up to boiling faster. So we just need two cups. And uh, one cup, and we got two cups, perfect. Got our rice sitting here, and then we want this also to reach boiling. So we'll take it up to a high heat. Then we're gonna reach in our spice cabinet. With this, we're just gonna add some kosher salt to this rice. It'll make it taste a lot better, trust me. Pop the top, add in a good amount in there. Bingo. We'll leave this out because we're going to need it. Give this a nice stirring. All right, that can sit for a minute. We want that to hit boiling. I'm also going to get four meal prep containers and sit them right here next to my cooking station. That way, as stuff is done, I can throw it in my container. Gotta think ahead here, guys. Use that noggin. And then for proteins, by and far, the easiest proteins I've found to prep, because you, one, don't gotta weigh them out, you don't gotta trim nothing, makes it super quick. We're gonna use a pack of 99% lean ground turkey, basically pure protein here. If you want to, swap this out for chicken breast, swap this out for white fish. It's gonna be about the exact same macros. This is just hassle-free. We'll be using 96.4 lean ground beef as well. Super lean, it's gonna have different flavor. It's gonna be a little different amino acid profile. Then it's gonna give us some diversity between our meals. One's gonna be red meat, one's gonna be white meat. You know the gist. So let's get to cooking this stuff. We'll start with the ground turkey. We're gonna hit a little bit of cooking spray in our pan here that's already heated up. Use some scissors, split this bad boy open. In case you guys notice, I'm going super fast. I'm trying to show you guys how quick you can really do this once you get it down. Get our ground turkey and toss it in. You just get your spatula, go down in here, get it into a bunch of little pieces. It's gonna cook way faster that way. Kind of stick here with it, man. You don't gotta leave for nothing. Once we got it in a bunch of little pieces, gonna add a nice little layer of kosher salt, boom, 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 and a heaping helping of some paleo powder, just right in there. So we're gonna stay with it and we're gonna keep working it. Okay, ground turkey is done. That is a full pound right there, over 100 grams of protein here. So we're gonna just split this up between two of our meal prep containers. Boom, 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 get in there, boy. And then put this back one too. All right, protein for two meals is down. Let's check on that rice. All right, it's gonna steam up if I get in too close, but basically 
basically once your rice starts boiling, you wanna take it down to a low simmer heat. Give it a nice quick stirring. Easy enough. We're gonna throw a lid on it and just let it sit there for a while. You'll know your rice is done because it'll absorb all the water and fluff up. So it's probably got maybe like five, six more minutes or so, but just keep an eye on it, man. Keep stirring it. You don't want to stick to your pan. Rice is almost done. So now we need to do our beef. We're going to hit the pan again with some cooking spray. Boom, boom. Same deal with our beef. Split this thing wide open. What's that look like? Throw it in our pan. Same thing as last time, man. Get in here and work it. The smaller your pieces are, the faster it'll cook. So once you get it at a manageable level, once again, we'll throw in some kosher salt. It's gonna add a ton of flavor, man, I'm telling you. Salt is not the enemy here, just drink your water. A Little bit more of this paleo seasoning, boom, 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 and then back to working it. And in no time at all, the ground beef is done, so we'll put it in our meal prep containers as well. Boom, 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 man. I'm telling you, this ground stuff, ground turkey, ground beef, whatever, so easy to prep, man. Literally, if you pre your pan, this is like almost instantaneous, really. Anybody can do this. Anybody can do this. Boom, boom, boom. Nice. Even these out a bit. I will take a little bit from this one. Put it in this one. All right. Looks a little more even. Let's check on our rice. Ah! Sit you over here. Boom. All right. It'll fog up if I get too close in there, but it's done. It's fluffy. Hold on. Can I get a zoom? Uh, yeah. I mean, you can't see that. But trust me, it's good to go. Let's move this right here. I'm just going to take my little spatula. We'll divvy out some rice between all these meals as well. Boom. Oh, come on. That doesn't look pretty. Number two. Number three. Number four. Four. All right, time check. It is 7.07, which means we basically got all four of those meals prepped in about 27 minutes. But, but I'm filming a video. I'm moving a camera. I'm trying to get good angles and stuff. So really, you could probably do this in about 15 to 20 minutes, for real. And that's four meals right here that are ready to go. Now, I didn't forget about veggies, and we got one other thing, and then this plan is almost done, man. I'm telling you, anybody can do this. If you fail to prepare, prepare to fail, man. But if you start your day off like this, you put your like best foot forward and your meals are ready to go, they're packed, they're good. You're not scrambling later than at lunch. You end up caving in and ordering a large deep dish. We've all been there. I get it. But when you do it this way and you make it easy on yourself, hassle-free, anybody can do this, man. This is not hard at all. I'm telling you, we just, you just got to do it. At the end of the day, a lot of stuff's easy. It just comes down to you doing it, right? Right. Now for veggies, I'm going to use zucchini for this. Really use whatever you want, man. If you like broccoli, use that. If you like asparagus, use that. If you don't like any vegetables, you don't need them, man. I did my first shreds with zero veggies. You just got to make sure you're getting that nutrition in somewhere else. So a good green superfood powder, multivitamin, you'll be good. But I will say, you'll feel a lot better having this stuff in, man. So zucchini being my favorite, just because it's so light, it barely tastes like anything. But it also helps fill your stomach up. That way, each of these meals, like, really fills you up, man. You're not going to be starving all day. Just go in with some scissors. If you're trying to be quick, just bap, bap, bap. Little pieces, man. The littler pieces you get things into, the faster it's going to cook. Makes this whole process, like I said, way easier. And when something's easier, you're more likely to follow it, man. That's just a true story. And each zucchini is, on average, anywhere from six to eight ounces. I mean, when it comes to veggies, you really don't gotta weigh them out when you're using certain ones because they're so calorically minor in the grand scheme of things. You can really eat just about as much as you want. Never heard of anybody getting fat off broccoli, man. True life, I ate nothing but zucchini. You just don't hear about that. This is a pile of zucchini, my friends. Boom, boom, and perfect. Let's get to cooking that. Like I said, man, preheating your pans is crucial if you want this to be quick. A Little bit of spray. Woo, she's smoking. Zucchini, let's go. Again, just stay here and work with it. And then to stay in line, we're gonna put a little bit of seasoning on this as well. A little bit of kosher salt too. Boom, boom, boom. And after a few short minutes, the zucchini is done as well. We're just gonna split this up. Boom, 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 and bingo. And then finally, we're gonna need a little bit of water, put it in a meal prep container type bowl thing. You know, the type bowl thing. Need about half a cup or 40 grams of old fashioned oatmeal down in here. I'm using this big spoon my mom got me. Love you, mom. Boom, 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 easy. We're gonna take one scoop of protein powder. I'm using Optum Nutrition Gold Standard. It's about the best deal you can get on Amazon for protein and it tastes good. So I got vanilla flavor, one scoop, put that down in there. Give this a stir real quick. You want it to mix up. It's gonna absorb all that flavor. Get any extra off our spoon. Now we need one cup or 140 grams of frozen blueberries. It's gonna be a lot of blueberries, I'm telling you. More than you think. Come on, baby. Perfect. Go in and mix this up too. Looks good to me. Yo, my bad. My camera, I forgot to hit the record button, so you missed out on a crucial step here. I did put 48 grams of natural peanut butter down in here. Pressed it in with some zero calorie strawberry syrup, so 
That is the end of that meal, baby. And, and we're done. We're done for the day. Check it out. And a little time check, it is 7.25. So start to finish, 45 minutes, but like I said, I'm filming. So you could probably cut 10, 15 minutes off of that. So in about 30 minutes, you can have this right here, man. Meal one, eight ounces, 99% lean ground turkey, about four ounces of zucchini, and 50 grams of white rice raw weight. The exact same thing again right here. The exact same thing, except instead of eight ounces of 99% lean ground turkey, we got 96.4 lean ground beef. Boom, the exact same thing again. And then this concoction right here, protein oats with blueberries, peanut butter, the whole nine yards, man. I'm telling you, you put this in the fridge, just let it sit for a little bit. It's all like absorbs together and it becomes super good. Or to make it more like dessert, man, you just pop it back in the freezer and let it freeze and then like pull it out like 20 minutes before you want to eat it. It'll like soften, but it has like an ice creamish consistency because it's cold. I don't know if any of that makes sense, man, but you learn to love the small things when you're dieting. I'm telling you, and this, game changer. And would you look at that, man, while everybody else is just waking up we've already taken steps to make ourselves better to make sure our day goes on our terms man that's what i'm talking about but when it comes time to transport all this man you can get yourself either a meal prep bag or you can just find like a cooler cooler works too man don't need that open her up meal one meal two meal three meal four and meal five will suck right down in there and then you get these bad boys on amazon for super cheap or probably a grocery store there's little ice packs these go down in the sides one on each side Boom, maybe one on top, one right there. You zip it up, boom, boom, boom. Sling it over your shoulder and you have all the success you need right here in a bag, man. You can get yourself a fashionable one too, bro. Take an IG pic with this, like, yeah, I'm about that life. You ain't as committed as me. So yeah, it is quite literally that easy. Now, like I said earlier, if you're not a big veggie fan. It took me years to get into veggies. Then you don't have to do them. Just make sure you're supplementing. So supplement like this, like Final Boss Greens Superfood Powder, man. One scoop of this a day. Keep the doctor away. Available on Amazon, FinalBossPerformance.com. Code RGF10 will save you 10% off of it, but 60 servings in one bag. Scoop a day, two scoops a day. If you want to feel better, just start scooping, bud. So now that we got everything prepped and ready to go, I'm going to break down exactly what is in this entire meal program. So if you want to follow it, you know what you're getting. So in this entire plan, if you eat all five meals exactly as I laid them out, you would hit 50 grams of fat, 262 grams of protein, and 216 grams of carbs with a calorie total of 2,362. Keep in mind, this diet for me, right, like if I follow this to a T, this is shredding for me. These macros for me will help me lean out, retain muscle, potentially even put some on and drop body fat. But keep in mind, all of us are different. My requirements could be different than yours. The next guys could be more than mine, less than mine. So this might be a good place to start, right, getting used to all this, but this exact program might not be specifically for your body type, the amount of days you train, the cardio you do, your metabolism, there's a lot of factors at play here. So what's cutting for me me might be bulking for you. Now, if you want help, if you want someone to break all this down for you, to make you a meal plan with your exact macros, whether you're trying to bulk, you're trying to cut, you're trying to just recomp, whatever you're trying to do, and you need someone to kind of lay it out for you, to push you, make you a training plan, whatever, check out my site, RemingtonJamesFitness.com. I can be your personal trainer, we can work together, and I can tell you exactly what you gotta do as easy as this video was. I can break it down as simple as you want it, as complicated as you want it. I can make you a program that I guarantee if you follow, you'll see results. At the end of the day, we are all a result of our routine. What do we do every single day, right? And keep in mind, this is just one day, but imagine when you take that one day, multiply by two, three, four, five, right? The benefits you get from each day, they stack, they're cumulative day after day, week after week, month after month. That is where the real results are, guys. So whoo, check out my site if you wanna work together. But appreciate you guys, as always, for watching the content, man. It means more to me than you know. Smash that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video. If you wanna see more videos like this or different styles of meal plans, you just gotta let me know in that comment section, man. It means the world to me that you guys even watch the channel, seriously. So now that that's over with, man, I got my meals prepped and packed for the day. I'm good to go. What else can we go conquer today, man? There's a million things out there. So all I'm gonna say is when I start my day off like this, I feel unstoppable for the rest of it, man. Thank you guys as always for watching. I will see each and every one of you at the next video. See you guys.